false claim reveals the truth behind his necklace story. The necklace the Duke of Sussex has claimed was ripped by Prince William during a physical altercation in 2019 is believed to have been a gift from his ex-girlfriend Chelsea Davy. In an extraordinary excerpt from his upcoming autobiography Spare, Prince Harry 38 claims he was left with visible scrapes and bruises after allegedly being attacked by his brother. In the explosive excerpt leaked to The Guardian he claims, William grabbed me by the collar, ripping my necklace and he knocked me to the floor. Harry has been pictured wearing the same necklace over the past decade, a silver pendant on a leather string, with previous reports stating it was a gift from Chelsea. Harry and Chelsea, who met while attending schools in London, dated on and off for six years. The Duke is believed to have started wearing the necklace at the end of that year and was pictured at a rugby match that November with the leather pendant around his neck. He was seen wearing the necklace throughout the relationship and continued to wear the pendant after the split in 2011. Chelsea said that she didn't want to become a princess because she wanted a career and a private life. In March 2012, the necklace fell out of his shirt while he was playing rugby during his tour of Brazil. At the time, the Daily Star alleged that Chelsea gave Harry the necklace as a gift in the early days of their romance. In an extract from the book, which was reported today, Prince Harry claimed his brother William branded Meghan difficult and rude in a stand-up row that ended with the Prince of Wales grabbing him by the collar and throwing him to the floor. The furious row allegedly broke out at his London home, Nottingham Cottage, in the grounds of Kensington Palace in 2019. William is said to have branded Meghan difficult, rude and abrasive, and insisted he was trying to help his younger brother during a meeting about the whole rolling catastrophe. Harry accused his brother of parroting the press narrative about his US wife before a screaming match ensued the book claims. Harry claims he gave William a glass of water and said, Willie, I can't speak to you when you're like this. Harry claims that William then urged him to fight back saying that's what would happen when they scrapped his children. But the Duke of Sussex says he refused, claiming that William left and then returned, looking regretful and apologised. William then turned and called back, You don't need to tell Meg about this. Harry claims he said, You mean that you attacked me? To which William replied, I didn't attack you, Harold. In other news, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have reportedly promised the royal family about there being more drama just around the corner. This claim has been brought to light by royal biographer Christopher Anderson. He made these admissions to Us Weekly, all while addressing the plans for the memoir. Mr Anderson started by saying, I don't think any rational person can look at this and say they're headed towards some sort of reconciliation. All of the bridges he's been burning, what's next? There's a sense you can top this. He also revealed that more projects are sure to follow since there's a sense of, you think you've seen something now, wait until I write volume two. Wait until Megan does a $20 million book deal. I'm sure there's a lot of drama just around the corner. Their strategy is working, it's boosting book sales for Harry but it's also making him frustrated that he's not getting any kind of response. When asked if the firm would ever be able to trust the Sussexes again, Anderson responded. Before concluding he also weighed in on the chances that Prince Harry will never be trusted again and revealed, I don't think they can. I don't even think they can be cordial with each other on the surface.